game. Damn, we don't get no love. A grand total of one first down. Time of possession was in favor of the Detroit Lions by an excess of 15 minutes. Four receivers for the Philadelphia Eagles and Riley Cooper. We don't get no love. All, All they're talking about is the Eagles, right how now. bad they is. They now want to say, along with oh, Hunt, they combined to get the How about the Lions? Game. They came to play. But no, they want to talk about and Chip Kelly and the Eagles. Detroit Lions. Who are trying to find themselves now But these are the Detroit Lions game. They are trying to find themselves Y'all see this shit And I love this show But Come on man Y'all gotta do better All y'all sit up here to do Is talk about the Dallas Cowboys And with each pass The lame ass Chip Kelly He wants to play For Chip Kelly Johnny Menzel He asked for control And bullshit Y'all gotta stop this man I love this show Y'all funny as hell But y'all gotta stop this man Give, give, give teams credit. We blew their ass out 45-14. Y'all was giving um, Tampa Bay credit. Give us some damn credit. Because clearly he was a product of their greatness. He didn't help. Terry Williams actually looked better than him. And looked give us some damn credit, man. When Terry Williams was with the Philadelphia Eagles. And DeMarco Murray, I mean... Give us some damn right credit, man. That's all I'm asking for. Enough, he's hiding from interview requests. Hold on, my team right, messed so up, y'all. I mean, it's just... Give us some damn credit. It's just an absolute joke. And Jeffrey Lurie needs to do the city of Philadelphia. That shit don't make no sense, man. And make sure that the second this offseason is over, he announces that they will be Now once did they say, oh, the Lions came and whooped their ass and, and blah, blah, blah. They ain't say nothing Chip like Kelly that. All they talking about is Chip is, Kelly his play and how bad the Eagles is. Play for him. <laughs> and I can assure you as somebody. Yeah, bad this one dicks up. The Cowboys all fucking day. Oh, last year, Tony Romo should have won the MVP. They beat the Lions in the first round of the playoffs. Yeah, why did they beat the Lions? Because it was a conspiracy? Because the referees got paid off? Oh, that was a catch at Packers. Oh, they got robbed. They should have beat the Packers. We got robbed too, motherfucker. The officials at... Let's say USC Get or this LSU, shit, man. if in fact Les Miles was fired. Dang, not once did y'all hear them talk about the Lions to, and say how good they play and say how fucking Ziggy Ansong was sacking the shit out of motherfucking Mark Sanchez. They ain't talking about that. But they ain't talking about how Kevin Johnson was just torturing their rookie um quarterback. Um, they ain't say nothing about how them Dill Riddick and Amir Abdullah was getting down on their ass. They ain't say none of that. That's that shit I'm talking about, Second man. Year, he did go ten they want to talk about the weak ass Cowboys. I reckon better than theirs. <laughs> but we can't get no shine, no play on TV. Even when we was winning last year, we didn't really get that much recognition on first tape. <laughs> it's cool though. It's cool. One day they're gonna be dick sucking us, and I'm gonna hold this shit out of them on Twitter every time. Fuck them, man. Fuck them. Straight up. Fuck them bitches. Still my show, but y'all niggas gotta stop talking about that bullshit, man. Like I got electrocuted. <laughs> Don't pay me no mind. But yeah, man. The fucking Lions fucking tortured this team yesterday. 45 to 14. I was at my girl's house for Turkey Day. And I was watching that shit. Boy, they was getting, they was getting in the Eagles' ass. <laughs> they was getting in the Eagles' ass. But look though, the Eagles look like they just gave up on Chip Kelly, dog. Like said, fuck this shit. They couldn't beat us anyway, not with that roster. <laughs> they couldn't fuck with us anyway, not with that fucking roster that he put together. He should be. I don't know how he's still a coach. We talking about Jim Caldwell, but I don't know how he's still a coach and running that team. I, I mean, I can't feel bad for y'all Eagles, cause shit. The Lions been medi uh, a fucking mediocre team for their life, man. So, I can't talk shit about y'all, but I can't say I feel y'all pain because I really don't. And I don't give a fuck. But let's get on these Lions. Calvin Johnson, three touchdowns from what? He had like 98 yards or some shit. Go to Tate was doing his thing. Amir Abdullah and Bill Reddick. Them two elusive motherfuckers was doing their thing. Stafford, I want to ask y'all a question. Do y'all still want Stafford going now? Do y'all want him gone now? Do y'all want Matthew Stafford gone? Do y'all still want Matthew Stafford gone? That's what I want to know. Because we lose this motherfucker. He wanted us to see somewhere else. And we're going to be mad. Like, why did we get rid of him? Keep him, man. Build around this team. Build, build a team around him. 
I say to whoever the next GM is, keep fucking Jim Bob Cooter as the motherfucking um, coordinator. Cause that motherfucker is a fucking genius on that offensive coordinator shit, man. I'm loving the place that he be calling this shit. You know what I'm saying? Uh, I'll, I'm glad the Bears won. Because if we go into Green Bay and beat, no, Green Bay coming to our house, we beat Green Bay. Then it's a slim chance that we can get to the playoffs or whatever. You know what I'm saying? So I'm kind of glad the Bears won. You know what I'm saying? And we already beat the Bears, so if it came down to it like a uh, wild card spot, we'd beat the, if 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 the tiebreaker would be on, uh, we because we beat them already. So I don't know, man. Hopefully we can get to it, but I don't think so. I'm just happy to see this team fighting, man. They could have easy packed it in, like I was telling them to do, like shit, get one of them draft picks. But they still they sticking together and they fighting, and that just shows that they didn't give up on Jim Caldwell. And it was just bad offense. Uh, it was just bad. Joe Lombardi. This team was a product of Joe Lombardi trying to uh, instill his weak ass offense, and it didn't work. And now that you see that everything is clicking now, like they buying into what Jim Bob Cooter is fucking preaching, spreading the ball around, cut routes, dipping dunks. It ain't just running the ball. That's something we didn't really see with um, Lombardi. He didn't really run the fucking ball. He did them little dink and dunk ass passes and shit. And you see him, Matthew Stafford, take deep down the field passes and shit now. So, yeah, man. Go Lions, man. The Pistons play today. They play the Thunder. They probably get their ass whopped on. But, hey, it's Friday. Good Friday. Y'all, man, the Lions won. They kicked the fucking Eagles. Them bitches. They whooped their ass. Put their ass in a motherfucking... Spin cycle, whipped they ass one time, did the dab, and then went home, ate they motherfucking turkey, and did they thing. But, uh, oh yeah, I seen Jason Jones yesterday too. His family was out there deep as hell on the corner last night. Jason Jones, the defensive end for the Lions, his family was out there deep as hell. I know all his people. <laughs> I know all his people. They people, his people know me too and shit. But, uh, and I seen him, um, not too long ago, like a couple months ago and shit. I think Memorial's Day. He came next to, he was next door and shit. From my grandma's house and shit on um, Greenfield and shit. Not too far from eight mile and shit, Greenfield and motherfucking um, between seven mile and eight mile. But yeah, man. The Lions did their thing. Go Lions. Keep Matthew Stafford, man. Build around him, man. That defense looking ferocious. Diggy Anson looking ferocious. And hey, let's keep doing this shit. Shout out to all my three um my my um one prior riders man three one three hit man man beast morris the ace takers lions mafia everything king all of y'all man let's keep this shit going warren up detroit stand up nigga it's still detroit versus everybody let go pistons they play today hey y'all check that out i'm gone man warren shit